U.S. Barrier Secretary Jim Mattis is thinking about utilizing dynamic vitality weapons on North Korea as a more secure other option to nukes or high explosives. By Aaron Kessel U.S. Barrier Secretary Jim Mattis indicated at utilizing an active weapon on Tuesday while examining pressures with North Korea when he made a Freudian slip. Mattis was asked whether there was any military alternative the U.S. can bring with North Korea that would not put so lat grave hazard, Mattis reacted, indeed, there are, yet I won't go into points of interest. Later amid the public interview, another correspondent addressed Mattis and found him napping. Just to illuminate, you said that there were conceivable military choices that would not make a grave hazard to Seoul, a correspondent inquired. Is it accurate to say that we are talking motor choices also? Indeed, I would prefer not to go into that, Mattis reacted. Already, Mattis expressed that a war with North Korea would include the huge shelling of a partner's capital, South Korea, which is a standout amongst the most thickly pressed urban areas on Earth. U.S. President Donald Trump in a discourse to the United Nations on Tuesday debilitated to absolutely pulverize North Korea if Pyongyang didn't stop its atomic testing and dangers. This likewise comes after the U.S. also, South Korea wrapped up its yearly military penetrate bothering of North Korea, helping the autocracy to remember its military nearness at its southern fringe. In 2015, the U.S. aviation-based armed forces affirm that military temporary worker Boeing has an electromagnetic heartbeat weapon, which is equipped for focusing on and pulverizing electrical frameworks without the blowback of murdering individuals. It's basically an EMP that takes out the power framework of a given range. The venture is known as the CHAMP, or Counter Gadget's High Controlled Microwave Advanced Missile Project, and it as of now has been operational since 2015 as indicated by Air Force Research Laboratory Authority Major General Tom Masiello. In January, Trump's Air Force head of staff uncovered to USA Today that the U.S. president could utilize space weapons against ISIS. On the off chance that we need to be more light-footed than actually we will need to drive choice expert down to some lower levels and specific zones the central issue that we must grapple with, is the specialists to work in digital and space, General David Gold. The Air Force head of staff, revealed to USA Today. Be that as it may, the U.S. likewise has other motor weapons in its arm stockpile that would enable Trump to absolutely crush North Korea. One of weapons framework is the Bars from God. What is the Rods from God? The Bars from God is a piece of the coordinated vitality weapon family, it's a dynamic vitality weapon. The Bars are coordinated weapons, the higher you are, the more prominent your separation from the planet, the more noteworthy the motor vitality you have. In 2004, distributed in Popular Science, Eric Adams composes. A couple of satellites circling a few hundred miles over the Earth would fill in as a weapons framework. One capacities as the focusing on and interchanges stage while alternate conveys various tungsten rods up to 20 feet long and a foot in diameter that it can drop on focuses with under 15 minutes notice. At the point when trains starting from the earliest stage, focusing on satellite charges its accomplice to drop one of its starts. The guided bars enter the air, secured by a warm covering going at 36,000 feet for each second practically identical to the speed of a meteor. The outcome, finish pulverization of the objective, regardless of the possibility that it's covered profound underground. The two-stage arrangement allows the weapon to be reloaded by simply propelling another arrangement of poles, instead of supplanting the whole framework. The idea of creating motor vitality weapons has been around since the 1950s when the RAND Corporation proposed putting bars on tips of ICBMs, in spite of the fact that the Pentagon won't state how far along the exploration is, or even affirm that any endeavors exist, referring to those points of interest as arranged. The U.S. Aviation-Based Armed Forces Transformation Flight Plan, distributed by the Air Force in November 2003, references hypervelocity bar packs in its framework of future space-based weapons, and, in 2002, another report from RAND, Space Weapons, Earth Wars, discusses the adequacy of such a weapon.
A space weapons ascension was proposed by Representative Dennis Kucinich called the Space Preservation Treaty in 2005 which expresses that nations won't try to weaponize space. Notwithstanding, that bill never influenced it past the prologue to arrange. Another House of Representatives charge known as the H.R.2977 Space Preservation Act was proposed in 2001 to boycott the utilization of outlandish weapons posting the accompanying. b. Such terms incorporate extraordinary weapons frameworks such as, i. Electronic, Psychotronic, or Data Weapons, 2. Chemtrails, 3. High Elevation Ultra Low Recurrence Weapons Frameworks, 4. Plasma electromagnetic, sonic, or ultrasonic weapons, v. laser weapons frameworks, vi. key, theater, strategic, or extraterrestrial weapons, and, 7. substance, organic, ecological, atmosphere, or structural weapons. Obama abused this understanding under the 2017 National Defense Authorization Act before leaving office and nobody saw that the enactment he marked is basically the Star Wars Defense Initiative 2 that his antecedent, Ronald Reagan, marked requiring a space-based rocket framework.